some time ago, and one of his most famous works, probably his most famous work, was The Hero with a Thousand Faces. I, I don't know how many copies of that book have been sold around the world. And a lot of people know the stories or have seen his famous series of uh, interviews by Bill Moyers, just wonderful. We have, we have it here. We've actually talked about doing a course on, on those, mm -hmm. uh, on the Power of Myth series, which would be a great thing to do. But most people don't recognize, because the hero's journey is divided into thirds. It's something called the call, the departure, and the return. And within the thirds, it's further divided into thirds or fourths, so anyway, it adds up to 12, ultimately. But the critical point on the hero's journey that we all have to undertake, because it's a metaphor for our spiritual path, the critical point on the hero's journey is when he meets and mates with a goddess. And it is by virtue of the hero's union with the goddess that he becomes the god or hero. It is through that divine marriage, which is talked about in many cultures, that the masculine principle, energy, starts moving upward and becomes enlightened. And as a result of the hero's union with the goddess, he becomes a god, and then he can go back to his people and lead. 